we have to find the limit as x approaches 0 of x times the cotangent of x solution. If you plug in 0 from the beginning, you get 0 times uh, cotangent 0, which is 0 times cosine 0 over sine 0, right? Because cotangent is cosine over sine. But that's a problem, right? Because sine of 0 is 0. So that's a bad idea. So maybe it's a good idea to rewrite everything in terms of cosine and sine, and then see what we can do and maybe use L'Hopital's rule. This will be x times cotangent, which is cosine x over sine x. Let's write it one more time. So this is the limit as x approaches 0 of x cosine x over sine x. And I think now it's a little more clear that we can use L'Hopital's rule. The reason is, if you plug in 0 in the numerator, you get 0, because 0 times cosine 0 is 0, right? 0 times any number is 0. And in the denominator, you also get 0, because the sine of 0 is 0. So now let's use L'Hopital's. So I'll indicate that by writing an LH here. So this is the limit as x approaches 0. And when we use L'Hopital's, we just take the derivative of the numerator and the denominator. Now in the numerator, we have to use the product rule, right? There's a product. So recall the product rule says if you have fg, it's the derivative of the first. So f prime times the second, which is g, plus the first, which is f, times the derivative of the second, which is g. So the derivative of the first is 1 times the second plus the first times the derivative of cosine, which is negative sine. Now, not everyone does the product rule like me, but if you already know how to do it, that, that's great. Uh, and then here, the derivative of sine is cosine. And now it's clear that we can just plug in 0, right? Because on the bottom, cosine of 0 is 1, so things are good. So here we get cosine of 0 times 1, but that's just cosine 0, and plus 0, right? Put a, put a 0 here, you get 0. And on the bottom, you get cosine 0. So you get 1 plus 0 over 1, right? Cosine of 0 is 1. And so we end up with, wow, we end up with 1. So kind of a neat problem. I hope this helps.